<clears throat> Thank you. Uh, it's, it's really a, a great honour to, to be here once again. Anyway, Tina Koto, greetings to you all. It is a great honour and pleasure to be talking to you today on this great day, World Down Syndrome Day. This day is important to raise awareness and stop the discrimination that still exists around the world and to speak up for the rights and inclusion and well-being of people with Down Syndrome. Today I'm thinking about my friends and everyone else with Down Syndrome from around the world. This day is for you. I really like the slogan with us, not not for us. As I know that too often people with Down syndrome are represented by others and do not get to take part. But this isn't right. They should be assisted to take part just like all other people with disabilities. The theme for today's forum Easy to understand communication is a very important topic. Everyone has the right to be communicated with and receive information in ways they can understand. It is easy read version of the Convention on the Rights of Persons with Disabilities, written by United Nations and ABLE. Article 21 is called, is called saying what you want and of course and access to information and it says countries must make sure that people with disabilities have the right to find out and give information and to say what they want the same as everyone else this includes information the way you need it easy read for example providing sign languages, braille and other ways of information, telling other services to do accessible information, getting the media, including the internet, to provide accessible inf information, supporting the use of sign language. We know this is not happening in all countries that have signed up to the convention. This means some people with disabilities are being left behind. I hope the resolution on easy to understand communication makes more governments take more notice. I hope it means more governments will become more aware of their communications and information and put it in all in place the rights in Article 21. I understand there is to be a dis discussion on the resolution at the comments of Tate parties in New York in June. My hope is that people will come together and get really clear about the opportunities this resolution can make and what that, that what is discussed is communicated around the world and plain language to all alternate formats. Now I want to touch on easy read information. I'm in my seventh year of being a member of the Committee for the Rights of Persons with Disabilities. When I first started, easy read information was sometimes mentioned by the United Nations and Committee, but there was confusion about how it was written. An example, sometimes it was written as easy to read, sometimes as one word easy to read, and sometimes as two words. And there was some confusion about what exactly it is. Some people thought it was plain language, or plain language of some pictures to make information look good. A good way to explain easy readers, information is written in everyday words and images to assist meaning. 
Here is more information about Asia Weed from People First New Zealand. Make an easy service website. Easy Weed is an interpretation, not a direct word for word translation, but distant from plain English, while it uses the same aspects of plain English as a starting point. It is a specialist form of communication. Easy Read sets standards, not just wording, but page layout, font, and accompanying images. I have spoken about Easy Read over the years, and now it's more understood and always mentioned alongside other alternate to the format such as braille and sign language and now it's always written as two words with a capital E and a capital R I think it is really important to have easy read written and understood the same all around the world braille is so why can't easy read be making it easy read information is not easy it is a skill and needs to be done professionally. People with intellectual disability have a role in making it too, as testers to make sure it is the best it can be. I would like to see experts of Easy Read get together to make some international standards. I have been to some countries where people with intellectual disability tell me there were a lot of people writing easy read but it is not done well and doesn't work for them anymore this is distressing to hear that is why I believe it would be good to bring experts together to try and stop situations like this happening and finish up I just would like to look forward to the discussion that will take place in June that, that what the next steps will be so that all people with disabilities receive communication and information that works for them so they can be participating citizens in their own country. Happy World Down Syndrome Day. Thank you very much.